Guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Office Blow Daz. I'm Gaynor. Office Blow Caden. Okay, before we start, if Patreon's your thing, head on over to the link below. Loads of stuff in there. Some good watch alongs. Modern yep. Family, F is for Family, Always Sunny in Philadelphia, Welcome to Wrexham, oh. The Quarterback, Seinfeld, plus quizzes, That's yeah. plus new. block content. Yeah. No, you've, never, you've never told him before. I know. <laughs> just letting everyone know. Yeah. Bargain and if, and if you scr or subscribed and you think you are, just check. It starts at $3 a month, goes all the way up to $5. Yeah. Loads of content on there. Have you ever heard of the Golden Girls, Aiden? No. Nope. I don't think I've ever seen it. This is Grandma's favourite show. She watches it every morning and she absolutely howls with laughter. Oh, really? Yeah. Mm. Let's get into it. What, anyway. is this a British or an American show? It's American. It's American. Yeah. It's about um, a group of um, older ladies. Okay. Let's get into it. The Golden Girls, funny moments. Blanche, what are you doing lining shelves on a Friday night? I'm working off all my excess sexual energy. <laughs> Why don't we just hook you up to the toaster and make pop time? <laughs> I've rewritten this thing three times, and the most persuasive slogan I can come up with is Save Our Swamps. No, really, we mean it. <laughs> I like it. Oh, no, you don't. No, I don't. It sounds like I'm selling mosquitoes, Rose. I mean, not that they don't serve a purpose. All life is precious. <laughs> <laughs> so that's when the salesman from men's sportswear walks clear across the store into ladies' petite and says, oh, excuse me, miss, but I notice you've been having a hard time deciding between the turquoise strapless and the flaming red backless. Well, personally, I would like to see you in the backless. And I said, when? And he said, how about Saturday night? And I said, how about in your dreams, Sleezo? <laughs> Can you believe the nerve of that guy? <laughs> what were you doing in ladies' petite? <laughs> <laughs> By the way, is that Ms. Zbornak or Mrs.? I'm hoping it's Ms. Well, yes. <laughs> yes, as a matter of fact, it is. Good. I've already got that box checked on this form. <laughs> <laughs> you can see why Grandma likes yeah. it, right? Yeah, I know. Yeah. I think she thinks she's one of them. Yeah, yeah, I think so, yeah. I mean, really looked at it. It's beautiful. And it's also amazing to think how much damage it could do if it fell into the wrong hands. <laughs> uh, Rose, are you going to be very much longer? <laughs> well, I'm just looking into alternatives. You know, hospitals have a rigid way of doing things. Oh! Why is she screaming? She's conscious. <laughs> I, I just want this to be an experience I'll never forget. <laughs> You're in luck. You're about to see one of our deliveries. We don't need the whole tour. <laughs> oh, Ma, come here. I want you to taste this. Well? Wouldn't it be easier to put a pillow over my face while I sleep? <laughs> <laughs> I have a two o'clock appointment for an AIDS blood test. My name is... Well, it's... You know, we encourage anonymity, so if you'd like to give us a fictitious name for our files... Oh, that'd be great. <laughs> Dorothy's Bornack. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> Let's try it now with Dorothy. Dorothy, Dorothy, Boborthy, Brana, Fana, Boborthy, B, Five, Bomorthy. Get out, Rose. <laughs> oh, now, wait a minute. You girls don't believe this. Well, I mean, I'm not denying that's me in the photograph, but I am denying that anything happened. I just dropped off his folder. Then why does it say here that you were in his house for two hours? We were just talking. Then why does it say the explosion was so great it shattered windows in the building next door? <laughs> Rose, that's an article about an earthquake in Guatemala. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going out with him. You go, Blanche. What? Well, you like him. I know you do, so you go. What? Well, I couldn't. Of course she couldn't. You stay out of this, dog. <laughs> well, why not? It's all over between us. He'll know that tonight. It's impossible. I I'd, I'd feel like a... I feel like a... A backstabbing slut? <laughs> no. <laughs> well, how about that nun over there? What if she guilts us into giving it to charity? Well, I think we can agree that that's the last thing we want to do. On the other hand, she is a shopping nun. She could be okay. Hello? Oh, hi. Yes, I heard you call. What a pleasant surprise. Well, I, well, I, I'm pretty sure I can make it. Just let me check my book. <laughs> I seem to be clear. I don't know what I'm going to... I'm convinced that's what your mum does to us. Probably, yeah. You say, do you want to go out on Friday night? So something to eat? And she goes, just let me check my calendar. <laughs> she goes away I for a bit. I've never put anything. I'm like, sat there with that going... Oh. You just hear the little feet going across the floor. Yeah. Which is probably just standing just, on... Yeah, I'm free. Do <laughs> about Jason. He's reached a point in his life where he's anxious to settle down and he wants us to have another child right away. <laughs> Well, frankly, I don't know if I want another baby so soon. I understand. Wait a couple years and Medicare will pay for it. <laughs> Why wait? Have it now and the Inquirer will pay for it. Ma, <laughs> oh, thank God you're here. Arrested for prostitution. I can't believe him, <laughs> Sophia. <laughs> Sophia, we're innocent. I know that. I can't believe these dumb cops would think anyone would pay money to sleep with you. <laughs> um. Is it any wonder I never breastfed her? <laughs> even know you were good at making malts. Good? I'm an expert. Didn't I tell you I used to work in a malt shop when I was in high school? Soda jerk? No thanks, I'll have a malt. I'm <laughs> gonna play or do you want to forfeit? No way. Now, Dorothy Zbornak doesn't know the meaning of the word forfeit. And she's a teacher, too. <laughs> <laughs> no wonder the Japanese are ahead of us. <laughs> It happened in class when she tried to do a six-count Cincinnati riff with a double pullback. It goes something like this. <laughs> Margaret Weinstein did the same thing when they changed her medication. <laughs> when I think of the things I've told Miles, the things he's told me, the things we've told each other, Things we've said in a restaurant. Things we've said on our way to a restaurant. Things we've said on the way home. The two of restaurant. you shared. We get it. <laughs> Complete this famous saying. Better late than... Blanche. Pregnant. <laughs> <laughs> Rose didn't lose Fernando. I, I gave him to Daisy when she was helping out with the rummage sale. Well, then there's no problem, honey. Just call Daisy and get Fernando back. She's a very sweet kid. She'll understand. I tried that. She said no. What do you mean? 
She's not a sweet kid anymore. She's holding Fernando for ransom. Come on. Dorothy, she sent me one of his ears. <laughs> Tell me, how long does Rose have to take care of this pig before she gets the money? It'll, as long as he lives. Oh, forget it. Well, I split the money with you girls. Forget it. How long does a pig live? About 25 years. Forget it. How old is this pig? 29. Welcome, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Exercising doesn't bother you? No, not at all. What is it, some kind of therapy you have to do? No, I just like to stay healthy. I have to break this to you, Bonnie. You're in a hospital. The exercises aren't working. <laughs> Dorothy, where's my heating pad? How should I know? If this isn't it, I'd like to know what other electrical appliance <laughs> you're using under that blanket. <laughs> Ma, now that you've finished, could I see that? <laughs> Next time I'll ask you to hand me the candlestick. <laughs> <laughs> I'm famous for my Lindstrom surprise. What in the world is that? Herring pie. This surprise is, you think it's pie, like an apple, you know, but when you bite into it, it's herring. <laughs> I think I see now how it happened. Last evening at dinner, when Miss McGlynn saw Blanche give Kendall Nesbitt her key, she was furious. She dropped a steak knife into her purse. Big deal, I took a whole place in Not now! <laughs> <laughs> Not your cup of tea, Aiden. Blanche, what are you? Don't say anything whilst that's going. <laughs> Not your cup of tea? Nah. No. No. I wouldn't. It's... I wouldn't watch that. That's the first time I've ever seen it. I've never watched it's, the Golden Girls. If you watch the full shows, they are really yeah. funny. Yeah, it's got funny moments. Yeah. I thought there's a lot, a lot of stuff in there that was quite humorous. Yeah. I don't know, and you can. I understand what the premise is of it. Yeah. You know, it's um, but because obviously I've heard about it over the years. Yeah. But uh, it's the first time I've ever seen it. Yeah. yeah. I thought it was quite funny. Yeah, it's funny. Mm. Yeah, you can sit like I say. You can see why your your mum likes it. It's an older yeah. show. It is an oldest show, yeah. yeah. No kids are watching that. No, people your no. age are watching it. I get yeah. that. Yeah. People their talking... age are watching it. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. I don't think even if it was on TV, I don't think I'd watch it. Don't know now. I think it's sort of like it's, it's past it's, my it's, time. It's a bit dated now. Yeah. yeah. But it, it was it was really funny. It's funnier shows on TV that I'd rather watch than that. But that has got some great clips in it. Yeah. I think it's yeah. a real funny show. Yeah. Yeah, enjoyed that. Yeah, yeah, it was good. Hope you guys enjoyed it as well. Don't forget like and subscribe. We'll see you on the next one. Cheers. Cheers. Bye.